hop into that journal and get a last time on Dragon Ball Z real quick. I think we only read up to Village Square, right? Yes, so uh, February 9th in the morning. How does Ethan know what day it is, man? All this happens in one day? God damn, man. Uh, Louisa's house. I found survivors huddled together in Louisa's house. I think she's the big wig here. Is she, though? But then one of them turned into one of those creatures. He slaughtered everyone there. I did nothing to do. I just, you know, I just kind of like ran away like a punk for once. Um, I get it. These monsters are the villagers, and this village is their den. I now know two things, that I'm the only one left, and that Rose might be in that castle. So that's where I'm going next. February 9th in the morning, a mine. I was on my way to the castle when I was captured by a group of five twisted freaks. Heisenberg, a hammer-wielding asshole. Dimitrescu is the tallest woman I've ever seen. Uh -huh, with a big old heart um, over her drawing, right? <laughs> Donna has some kind of creepy doll. Moreau is some nasty puss-spewing thing. And last of all, their mother Miranda. They can control those creatures, too. Who? What are these people? Did they really go over their names? I don't remember them going over their names. <clears throat> Ethan's just so astute, he he guesses names or something, right? He's He has psychic powers, like Luis, you know? <coughs> uh, in front of the castle, some merchant calls himself the Duke. Peered out of a horse-drawn caravan, he seems to know what's happening here. I don't trust him. <laughs> but I don't have time for that. I need to search this castle for Rose, or at least some clues. Uh, castle Chambers. Ooh, this is where the journal gets kinky, huh? Uh, this castle looks like something straight out of a gothic horror movie, complete with giant noble woman and her three witch daughters. But they caught me while I was looking for Rose and strung me up. I had to bite the bullet in order to get loose. Hurt like hell, too! Exclamation <laughs> point. Oh, Ethan. <laughs> a lot of boots. A lot of, a lot of leftover boots in this game. Very strange. Well, this is fucking rickety as hell. Yeah. <clears throat> and this is, uh, oh, you can't go back. Like, come on, Ethan, you could fucking jump that. That is a tall mannequin. Don't get too excited now, Ethan. Mother Miranda, I regret to inform you that Ethan Winters has escaped that fool Heisenberg. Because he is in my castle and has already proven too much for my daughters to handle. When I find him... No, Mother Miranda. Yes, of course, I understand the importance of the ceremony. I won't let you down. Good. To hell with the ceremony! That man will pay for what he's done. I'm sorry. Now, Jimmy the... The lock. She's like, who's in there? <laughs> no one! Oh, she has a crib, huh? What? I mean, seriously? We, we, uh, okay. Well. What do I know about windows, right? God damn, that's beautiful. Oh, except for all the dead guys down there, huh? That's, that's, uh, I don't know. Hmm. Talk about being big boned, yeah. Indeed I am. Right. <laughs> Who's putting money in these, uh, in these vases? These exquisite, expensive vases. Just breaking everything like an asshole. We gotta try and fit in her dress real quick, Ethan. God damn, man. It's locked. Yeah, there's a crib there. We were all called by Mother Miranda to decide the fate of the child's father. Just thinking of that family meeting makes me shudder to think I am treated like a sister to those miscreants, especially Heisenberg. That riffraff wouldn't know proper manners if they slapped him in the face. I would have sliced him to ribbons if mother hadn't stopped me. Why does she treat me the same as them? She gave me this castle, obedient daughter's everlasting life, did she not? Am I not her favorite? Am I not special? I need a drink. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> 
Yeah, of course we have to break all the, the jars, you know? We don't know what's in there. I, I think Ethan is secretly like a kleptomaniac or something, right? Like, he needs to know what's, like, going on in, in, in places and shit, you know? Like, what's in this drawer, you know? Like, it's a good skill to have, but, you know, it's also kind of rude. Rose, where are you? I need to get Rose out of here. Uh, oh, uh, that's out back to the hall, isn't it? Yes. <coughs> it's locked from the other side. Missing something in here, evidently, huh? Oh, that's cool. Her fucking lipstick is, uh, fell down there. What, uh, what are we missing? Oh, is there... Oh, that's right, she put the, the thing here, huh? Crap, we have a lot of places to go now with this key, huh? Oh, I left my handgun empty, didn't I? Oh. Oh, boy, we don't have a single heal on us. Let's go ahead and craft one, huh? A key decorated with a flower and swords motif. <clears throat> that is pretty. Who makes all these elaborate keys, right? All my keys are fucking boring. <coughs> I need to step my goddamn key game up. And, oh, it said you were locked from the other side, huh? Yes, yes, indeed. Oh, boy. Oh, shit. <laughs> All this for a child who isn't even here. What the hell do... Uh, that's right, I'm a child. Selfish wretch. You come into my house. Ow. Oh, boy. filthy man hands. I did it. She came after me, Howie. God damn, Ethan, get up. <laughs> oh, shit, what? Rest while you can, because I will hunt you, and I will break you. I am excited. Go ahead, do your worst. Yeah, do your worst. Ethan sounds excited, too, huh? You know, she could have just killed us right there, but, you know. Just saying, right? All these Resident Evil villains got a Dr. Evil it up, right? Some monies! That, are those blood buckets? Are those paint buckets? Huh. Bunch of fucking boots all over the goddamn place. Who leaves all their fucking boots in this castle? Goddamn! Oh, this is supposed to be a dungeon? Yikes. I thought the other place was the dungeon. Dun dun! And that looks like hella trapped, right? <laughs> Oh, a lot of money. And chem fluid. Dun dun. Uh, another switch. Which I assume is what we have to press, right? Uh, yep. Yeah. <clears throat> sure looks like it. Ah, man, I don't want to reload if at all possible. Hey, you're tired of shit after work? Yeah, leave your boots wherever you please. All 200 pairs of them, huh? God damn. Ah! Oh, shit! Uh... You'll be sliced to ribbons. Wow. It's gonna be real hard to reload my gun now. <laughs> Uh, crap, is she? No, I'm still in... Ah! Oh my god. I need my hand back, please! 
God damn, man! What the fuck? Oh! Man, I could have gotten a, a quick little yak high five on the booty right there, huh? I could have held my severed hand right to yak I got the high five on the on the booty there. <laughs> Dun dun. Uh. Uh. Hello, ma'am. <laughs> God damn, man. I'm sorry. Your daughter was really mean to me, though. Oh my god, fucking use the key, Ethan. Oh, good lord, <laughs> use the key! Oh, hey, we got a mask. Oh, shit. <laughs> Running will get you nowhere! Well, that was something. Good god, Ethan. Yep, here we go again. Good lord. <coughs> and my sleeve gets perfectly healed as well, huh? Oh shit, we're fucking, uh, what's called? Back up into the, uh, courtyard, huh? Good. Man, screw this castle. Screw your life, Ethan. Good lord. This. You are cursed, my friend. Yeah, I bet it's hard not to spoil this shit. <laughs> Thank you, though. <clears throat> oh, yeah, that's magical juice, all right. Uh. Crap. Just one? We should be able to get back to uh, the Duke. And we're still missing something out here in the courtyard, huh? Was it this way? Oh, hello. Let's get this capacity upgrade, baby. Oh, Duke. Pleasure to see you safe. How well, I lost my fucking hand. Got it back, though. No sign of Rose. <clears throat> so sorry it turned out that way. Hmm. Well, you'll find your way to her once you're out of this castle. Do you have need of anything for the road? Hell yeah. Thanks to your consistent patronage, I've expanded my services. Ah, yes. Yes, yes. Do you happen to have a, a, a spare right hand? Yeah, he keeps saying that he has uh, a samurai edge. Huh? Should we try to purchase the... Uh, I guess let's purchase the the Lemmy's fucking high cap mag, right? Uh, let's say no. Let's see. So it is not reloaded currently. Let's equip the part. Yeah, it reloaded me. All right, awesome. We don't have the sniper yet. Fuck okay, it, I guess let's pick up the the mine yes, schematic. See why you'd be interested. Yes, yes. You love blowing shit up, don't you? Like, uh, kind of, you know, I I, I dabble. I dabble. Um, so. So we have, yeah, her key. Which, oh, the tasting room. Ah, your iron insignia. Damn, I wanted to go back down there. Is that the only other? God damn, how many fucking sections to the castle are there? Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Disgusting outsider. She really likes, um... Uh, she really likes kinky foreplay talk, doesn't she? Uh, 
Okay. We gotta save right now. Should I? <laughs> Should I fight her? <laughs> God damn, I think it's a bad idea. <laughs> she just gives no fucks. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> this is fun for me too, sweetie. Oh boy. I'm a widower. <laughs> God damn. Yeah, I'm guessing she is just fucking immortal. <laughs> That's so fucking cool. Man, she doesn't even stop, does she? Damn, blocking her is fucking worthless. You know, Mr. X at least stopped after getting hit like several times. Oh, she sort of stopped for a second there. <laughs> Wow. Okay, well, I think we properly, um, guessed the situation. <laughs> yeah, she is just unstoppable. That's how I like my women, unstoppable. <coughs> Can we drop the chandelier on her? You have a beautiful black corsage or whatever, whatever it is. Yeah. She quick as hell, huh? Ah, uh, Ronnie Van. Oh, seriously, lady? Oh, there's some. There's some, some shanky ladies out here. Lady D come out here is the real question that I'm keeping my eyes peeled out for on the side up there. Oh boy, owie. Ow! God, she's carving me up like a goddamn turkey. Oh, yeah, she's out here. <coughs> Damn it, I need that crystal skull. Come on, Lady D, I just want the crystal skull. Indiana Jones in the temple of the crystal. Oh my god, giant vampire lady, right? Uh, I think that's a dead end over on that side, so... Uh. Ow! I'm persistent. Man. Man, is she just gonna follow me through the d Wow, did she just bitch slap her fucking little, little thrall away? I mean, she's just gonna follow me through here, right? Oh my lord, Ethan! Oh, an extra map to the annex? Damn. Oh, that's not a door, dumbass. <laughs> and I sort of want to kill those, um... Uh, little, little vampire gals. Oh uh, yeah, she's still out there. Okay. <clears throat> I should not have pressed my luck. 
Uh, please be aware the mistress's lipstick is missing. If anyone finds it, could they please return it to her bathroom? It is custom made and therefore very expensive. The grand chamber maid. To the library, huh? The hall of joy. I wonder what happens in there. I hear more vampires about. Oh, do I? Yeah, I think I see him right there, right? Uh, what is this? Uh, one day since treatment, the three girls have stopped moving. They seem almost dead. An insect flew out of the eldest's mouth. It appears to be a common fly. Two days since treatment. All three bodies are covered in flies. It appears the flies are consuming their flesh. When I opened a window, some of the flies dropped dead to the floor. It would seem the cold petrifies them. I quickly closed the window to avoid weakening the insects further. Four days since treatment. All three bodies have almost been completely consumed by the insects. All that is left is a dark, writhing, human-shaped mass of creatures. It is just afternoon, and the insects have started to change color. Those around the face turned pale, and those around the lips turned a deep crimson. Six days since treatment. The mass of insects has transformed into human bodies again. All three girls awoke, looking at me like newborns. I sense a bond between us, like mother and daughters. I have already decided their names. Bella, Daniela, and Cassandra. Creepy. Creepy, 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 creepy. There's a challenge to break all the windows in the castle? I'm on it. Are you being serious or not? <laughs> She just moving into the corner? She humping the corner? She doing the stanky leg on the corner? Oh! So, uh, what's it called? I found out, uh, I was even complaining yesterday, why can't I, um, push enemies away sometimes? You can only push enemies away if you have a weapon out, and the knife does not count. Berg. Oh, globe! Flower, swords, ball. Okay. Yeah. -ha! Hey, there's another like figurine right there, right? Wow, that was cool. You can like, wow, you can like slash up the. Not everything hits though, huh? That's really cool though. Wow. Amazing what you do, Capcom. I still kind of wish they did, um, laser sights, you know? Oh. Alright, we'll get that right now. There's more pressing matters. Larga! Pretty teeth. Huh. Yeah, I guess the crystal fragments are pretty much our spinels, right? Except they sell for more. <laughs> more rusted crop. Some gunpowder. They're giving me a lot of good stuff. I don't like this. Yeah, someone's gonna fucking jam my hands on the piano. <coughs> Uh, scientific name, none. Size, five to six centimeters. Uh, similar body structure to blow flies, although there are differences in the head. They are carnivorous and vigorously consume meat. In order to catch unsuspecting prey, they'll gather using pheromones to mimic a human. They are produced when a kadu lays eggs in its host, but the flies themselves are unable to reproduce. They are weak to sudden drops in temperature, especially if the temperature drops below 10 Celsius, 50 Fahrenheit. Height, their metabolism lowers and they go into a dormant 
cryptobiotic state, similar to the cryptobiosis of tard tardigrade or polypedelium vanderplanky? Boy, it's a good thing Ethan knows all about Vanderplanky. There's something else still down here, or does it count as the the hall upstairs? Oh no, we got the the scrap and the what's it called, huh? I really don't want to examine this peony. I have a bad feeling about this peony. Oh. Uh. Uh, I'm definitely not good with, uh, what's it called? Ethan, you play beautifully. Uh, we're not looking at your beautiful hands play, though. Anyway. Ah, uh, all right, sure. Vanderplankus is my favorite. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, bless you. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, so this is the good key that we need, right? Yeah. Oh, we can go out through the kitchen instead, right? Oh, because we fell through, um, uh, we fell through the what? You call, oh man, armory. What? Oh, the hall of pleasure as well. Never mind. What's fucking in there, right? Hall of joy is good, but you know, I think hall of pleasure is where it'd be at. Oh shit, we also have to go and check that room that uh, Lady D came out of, huh? Oh shit, should we just go upstairs actually? Yeah, there was an iron insignia thing up here, huh? Ah! Ah! This one's gonna be the death of me. Please get out of my way. She moves very fast. Oh yeah, here's her giant ass bathtub. Oh hey, I found her lipstick. Peace offering? Is it a key item or? It's her treasure, oh okay. <coughs> <coughs> Maybe Ethan will just keep this one for himself, huh? Mm -hmm. My lord, okay. <laughs> ah! <laughs> There's nothing else here, right? <laughs> I when you leave the map menu, Ethan just like literally stops for a second. Uh huh. Okay. Ah! <laughs> Run! All right, I'm gonna need you to move, please. Ah! She sounds like she's on my ass. <laughs> Obviously not. <laughs> you don't gotta be so mean, though. God damn, Lady D. <laughs> She's just trying to help. <clears throat> wow. Duke, are you seeing this shit? Aha. <laughs> uh -huh. uh -huh. Thanks, Duke. Fight her off for me, will you? All right, I think that thing we got is for. Oh, let's uh, let's examine it, right? 
<coughs> a ball made of metal decorated with a flower and a sword. Looks like there's a hole for something. Sphere. Oh, it's talking about uh, this. That was fucking bleeding uh, through or something, right? Yeah. Obviously, the Mask of Sorrow fits here, right? Damn. <coughs> uh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, you can do it, buddy. Oh, did I get it over? <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> and this is what you've been talking about this whole time. This is the mini game that you've been talking up. <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I'm sure it gets, uh, what's it called, right? I'm sure that shit gets, starts getting like fucking complex. <laughs> of the mad skills I'm just sitting there on. <laughs> Fucking, I'm fin vaulting. <laughs> Lady D even comes in the room behind you. Oh, 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 you almost got it. <laughs> All right, I don't think we're gonna... Thank you for your patronage. God, don't yell at me. She just stalking the shit out of us? I'm in the save room. <laughs> Leave me alone. Ugh. Ah, you don't see me. You. I've been waiting on you to die. There. Thank you for your money. Well, Lady D's uh, keeping my pucker factor at a minimum. We should uh, try to see what I'm missing here. Hmm. Yeah, this is one of the areas that is just absolutely. Aha! 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 A herb! There we go. Alrighty, let's go this way. See if Lady D somehow fucking zoomed up here. <laughs> oh. So you finally came to see uh. everyone falls to me. Well, you are gorgeous, my dear. Oh boy. <laughs> Okay, well, we're not gonna break that. Can I hurt her? No, I cannot. Shit. Uh. You wanted to see me? I did too. Crap on a cracker. We don't break that, or? Ow, 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 ow. Bad boy. You oh, what's this? It. Yeah! Why these women are choosing to fight in, uh... Hey, where are you going? Oh, crap, do I have to keep opening this thing? Yeah. I see you, my dear. Oh, she's flying towards me like a goddamn flying Dutchman. Oh, my lord. Tony, I've never been so conflicted in my life. Why are you ladies choosing to fight in these uh, obviously bad areas Why for you? you a dream. This is a dream. More like a nightmare. 
<laughs> Put those arms down! What are you doing? Fighting back! Ah, I'll run even! Oh! Oh my god, even! That hurt? Yeah. I'm sorry. I don't, want I don't want you to die either. This really sucks for me too. I'm sorry. I'm sick of bugs. <laughs> Ethan's just like, eh, whatever, bitch. Like, god, damn, Ethan, you cold fucking bastard, carrying their fucking torsos around and shit. Yeah, I'm s like, don't get me wrong, like. I guess the internet kind of um, blew everything out of proportion, especially like with the castle section and everything. But like, yeah, like yeah, they're all already dying, you know, like and it's all my fault and it doesn't feel good. You know, I was hoping I was kind of I guess like we kind of thought that like they were going to be the um, entire game kind of, you know. Oh, well. You'll live on in our hearts in the internet forever, ladies, for sure. Oh, this is the Hall of Joy, yeah. <coughs> Unlock you. Uh, that is a creepy ass door, right? Whoa. Fuck is up here. Oh, are we supposed to shoot that bell? Uh, let's read with a note here is, I guess. Huh? Let the five bells of this chamber ring out. Wow, that is a gorgeous picture. Oh, cool little owl book. What is, what, what is that book? I don't know. Oh, there's a teeny tiny bell. Five bells? God damn. Oh, you missed the, lis the lipstick? Damn. <laughs> oh, whoopsies. I almost shot that. The fucking counterweight or whatever. Oh, do I have to shoot them? Do they have to be on fucking fire or what? Whoa, okay. Ah, damn it. And we're going to have to reload. What's going on? What's moving or what? Oh, okay. I mean, I guess. Should we go grab the mask of my jig real quick? Fuck me. Let's go check it out, I guess. I love this little turtle guy, man. I'm gonna take him with me. Rose would love him. Uh. Yo. Fuck you, pot. Ugh, 
Oh boy. <coughs> now Lady D's up here too, right? Sexy male mannequin thing. Hey, goat guy. Huh? I'm probably gonna have to shoot, huh? Can we stab him? Yeah. Yeah. Ah, okay. <laughs> we'll shoot it. Let's <laughs> shoot it. <laughs> oh boy, I'm gonna have to fucking censor that, huh? Gunpowder treasure map. <laughs> That's a trap, yo. Come on. <gasps> Lockpick? Fuck yeah. Perhaps Ethan, the master of everything, should take it. Heard there was something called the Dagger of Death's Flowers somewhere in this castle. It's apparently an antique from the Middle Ages that's coated in a concoction of poisons from across the continent, said to have been crafted to kill demons and monsters. It sounds fascinating, but no one knows where it is. Oh, well, hello. I thought this would have been in the armory. <laughs> Well, all right. Uh, th this is your zoom in? Okay, whatever. The rifle does 600. <coughs> okay. Sweet. Yeah, beautiful baby is right. <coughs> Oh god, why are you auto-saving, game? What the fuck are those? Um... Right. Should we be going through the rooftops already? Me thinks, me thinks we're gonna go the other way. Me thinks we're gonna go use this treasure map and other things before we go fight the evil demon. Gargoyles, Ethan, uh, Ethan has uh, amazing knees and unstoppable ha uh, arms and hands, okay? This man is goddamn fucking Superman. They would have stole this baby from anyone else, um, <laughs> God damn it. Okay. I was like, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead.